Hey guys, I'm back again. Uh, today, I'm working on the steel for the ISO frame that'll be mounted on the back of the truck. Uh, only reason I'm doing that instead of working on the engine is because my buddy is bringing over his really big welder from Oklahoma and he'll be here in about a week so I need to get that ready and done before he shows up uh, and honestly it shouldn't take me that long but I figured since it's not going to take that long to do and all that I'll go ahead and record a video for it and make something out of it so flip you around and we'll show you when it needs to be done this one's completely done um there's one uh, let's see if i can zoom in aha i can zoom in sweet and see uh, uh, well that little blue post is the other one but it is missing one tiny uh it's missing the end cap for the uh for it but otherwise is done uh, this piece of I-beam is straightened out. Uh, the length was off just a hair from the uh, shop and it was cut not quite square, so I had to square that up. This, <clears throat> this piece of C-channel is marked out. I gotta cut it here and then down. And then this will be, well, i got to do the same thing down here. But then this will be ready, uh, at least in one end. So all I've got to do is uh, these two pieces of C-channel. And there's the other piece of I-beam is sitting right there. So i got to drag that back here. i got to drag that. I'll probably put it over here. Well, actually, I'll put it behind me because that's as long as my extension cord reaches. Anyways, put you on the tripod. Shouldn't take too long to do this. So, oh, and this time I found my uh, shotgun mic for the phone because I noticed that the lapel mic wasn't working. I have no idea why, so... I guess I'll just have to start shooting video in with the uh, shotgun mic instead. It was just a cheap one, so hopefully it lasts or still works. Actually, I suppose I should check that. Anyways. Oh yeah, 
forgot. I got a little piece of cutoff. So I can show you what I'm actually planning on doing with the, uh, the coping. Basically, that's what's going to happen. I still need to do some grinding here on the corners right here. But it shouldn't be too much. I've only got a quarter of an inch gap here to deal with. This gap that will be left here uh, should be fine. A couple of passes on with uh, some 6010 should do it just fine. Sheds-a-lot. Hey, Mr. Sheds-a-lot, that's your fur. Yeah. Anyways, uh, figured I'm gonna have to put you guys on pause because I gotta go find my square and my marking pen and my um, uh, the uh, the other one <laughs> that I forgot the name of all of a sudden. Anyways, yeah, what's probably going to take me a couple of hours to find is only going to take you a couple seconds, so I'll see you in a bit. Okay, found all my marking tools, but now the phone's about to die. So I'm going to go plug that in, get it charged up real quick, and then I'll be back out here with, uh, with y'all in tow. <laughs> right, Chief? Right, buddy? Whoa. Right, buddy? Hold on. We gonna invite them along, huh? We gonna invite them along, huh? Huh? Good boy. All right, come on.
y'all. Thanks for joining me with part one of the ISO frame build. Hopefully by next time I will have some stumps cut since I still have some firewood left so that I can level out the frame and get it propped up a little bit for when my buddy shows up with his uh, with his welder. I would do it with the battery operated one, but I've only got 23 thou wire, and that's not going to be enough to get this uh, get this heavy gauge, this heavy steel, even tacked together. So. Probably just wait until he shows up with his welder, and then we'll uh, we'll tackle it together. So until then, I've got a couple other things I need to get to working on, anyways, like the truck engine, and there is something else I was thinking of. I don't remember what it is now, but. Yeah. Till I see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you liked it, go ahead and hit the like button and go ahead and subscribe because there's going to be more videos on the way, uh, specifically on this shipping container and the truck, and then whatever el whatever other random stuff around the. Uh, around the homestead like cats <laughs> meow what are you doing buddy uh so oh yeah one other thing I did create a patreon page um so if you want to help support the channel feel free to uh Drop a donation, even if it's only a dollar. I don't care. Uh, every little bit count, or every little bit helps. So, yeah. Till next time. Catch you around. What are you doing, buddy? Huh? What are you doing? You just want to come up here and lay on my lap. Just this. You just want to come up here and lay on my lap. I really should have named y'all. You know that? Cat one and cat two. How about that, huh? Or male cat and female cat? What do y'all like? What do y'all like, huh? Which one? You want cat one? You want cat two? Try to come up here too, Mama. What you doing, Chief?